Ladies and gentlemen, another food, another food review. All right, but this time we're gonna be talking about a restaurant called, uh, or a fast food joint called uh, Freddy's. All right, Let, let's quickly, you know, uh, let me get my order here really quickly. All right, boys. For those of you that don't know what Freddy's is, uh, think about it, right? Okay, so if you don't know what Freddy's is, I'm sure you know what In-N-Out is. All right, In-N-Out is this like burger joint in uh, uh, around like the popular areas. Like it's most famous in California. And it's a burger joint, and they have, from what I heard, pretty banging burgers. You know what? This is pretty much the Midwest equivalent of that. Because I don't think there's going to be any shot of us having an In-N-Out burger here. So today, we're answering the question, the age-old question that no one has thought of. Is Freddy's actually good? All right. Now I can't lie to you guys. I've I've uh, I've had Freddy's plenty of times. So the short answer is God yes, yes. It is absolutely delicious. Long answer. We'll keep watching the video. Which by the way, for the for those of you that you know, th th this isn't gonna turn into a food review channel. Trust me. All right. The only reason why I've been doing like a decent amount of food reviews recently is because I want to catch up on. Um, on the videos I'm like three days behind or four days behind and I it's easy for me to edit like a food review video because it's, it's just a food review compared to like a normal vlog where I would have to you know put the stuff together so this time will be just another food review something simple and um, I'll, I might have to do a couple more before you know before I stop doing it for a while because like I said I just got to catch up but yeah that, that's for the people that are curious well let's see how long how long is this take I think uh, I think I've been sitting here for about a few minutes thank you so much have a good one boys we have gotten the food yes yes time to grow I can't lie I haven't had anything to eat yet yes I know I know it's bulking season I get it that I, I get it so I understand I understand the concern ladies and gentlemen and I appreciate the concern now let's try you know th there shouldn't be any concerns after this anymore because God knows this probably has a billion calories so whenever I go to Freddy's I always have their um, it's like this oh wait they, it's packaged differently now they usually put it in the box but but now it's here so this is the jalapeno cheeseburger everything. Bang. And like I said, I've had this before, so um, I already know the answer to what this is gonna be. I ordered a jalapeno burger, like I said. I ordered some fries, and I also ordered a chili cheese dog. Magnifico. It's gonna be a great day. And also, just like every restaurant or fast food places nowadays, they also have their own like signature sauce. When it comes to burger joints, I think Freddy's has probably the best like signature sauce i guess from what i've tried right people are gonna be like oh this this and that oh it's better uh, yeah well i don't i don't know bro the best i've had all right no drake string fries mm. god damn this is called the jalapeno fry sauce by the way those will be curious jalapeno fry sauce they also have a normal fry sauce but yeah living life on the edge here a little bit so uh getting the spicy and stuff mm. oh damn the fries eight eight out of ten the burger bon appetit so in here is their like fry sauce and also jalapenos i wish they would have put more jalapenos but what can you do <laughs> bottoms up or no bon appetit bang as always and what i like to do I like to dip this in there boom this right here is a very solid competitor to, to the flamethrower burger by by, Bur uh, by not Burger King, Dairy Queen. This comes very close to the, the flamethrower. I don't know which one's better to be honest at this point. I like both of them a lot. Buns toasted, crispy on the edge. I'm talking about the edge of the burger. Very crispy. And you can't have this burger without talking about the sauce. The sauce, man. This burger right here, a nine, a nine. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm saying. I haven't had these um fast food places in a very long time this one has been the longest mcdonald's was the most recent which probably like a month ago and then wendy's was like a few months ago i've been doing such a decent job at like clean bulking for the most part and then here we are one week and i'm just gonna destroy all that work good thing i'm bulking i'm not cutting <laughs> otherwise this uh, this would be unfortunate what's your guys' favorite um burger topic mine would be either jalapenos pickles or you know mushrooms onions it can be raw or cooked no matter oh fries god damn the boy is happy definitely a much better experience than yesterday or last night sorry for those of you that haven't watched uh the previous video i reviewed the krabby patty like meal that wendy's have and i rated it like a six and a six and a half out of ten because the fries wasn't all of that it was a four i think that i rated it the sprite was all right you know for obviously the sprite um the krabby patty itself it was just it's just a gimmicked version of the 
double cheeseburger by you know by Wendy's. Just a double cheeseburger with a little bit of veggies. That that's it. And I know I shouldn't have expected that much, but you know I, I feel like there should have been something a little special to it, especially with the whole Kaisenat stuff uh, with McDonald's coming out. It's like like a chicken Big Mac. That's a pretty cool idea. But this right here. to die for now since i mentioned that this is like the the midwest version of of in and out if i get the opportunity i want to fly to california just to have a an in and out burger and to see see if it tastes good or see which one tastes better right the burger is almost done Girl! the freddy's experience is not over yet because we still got the chili cheese dog open it up oh, pow God, I think I'm only gonna take one bite of this and eat it at home because this this is too messy. Holy shit! It's been a while. It's been a while, but I'm fighting my faith. If everything's good and it's great, why do I sit and wait? Been a while, but I'm finding my faith. If everything's good and it's great, why do I sit and wait till it's gone? Cheese, chili, onions, glizzy, hot dog or bun. Sorry, bon appetit. Don't meme this. I swear to God. Oh, shit. oh yeah. Oh, wow. it is a shame that it has been a while since I've had this. The bun, you can see it right here. The bun is toasted, and normally that toast feeling doesn't last that long. And by the time you eat it, it won't feel toasted anymore. This still feels toasted. The chili is delicious. The onions smack. I love raw onions. I think I don't know. I think I know a lot of people don't, but I I, I like it. Yeah, holy fuck! Only two bites. 9 out of 10, already. Oh my god. I forgot exactly what I rated the the chicken Big Mac meal from from McDonald's. Or the Kai Sinat meal, whatever. But this tops it, 100%. I gotta start contemplating, holy shit. Man, oh man. Gotta finish up the sauce, you know what I'm saying? <coughs> 9 out of 10. And I haven't even finished my meal yet, so there's still more fun to go around. My goodness. My goodness, ladies and gentlemen. Like I said, 9 out of 10. Thank you for watching. <laughs> that, turn around. No, I got up. Begging me to go, but I tell her to stop it. Always got the key, and my heart is the lock it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like a pro, but you're really a novice.